Hello, perfectly imperfect people. I'm Jenny Lou, and today we have a Wizarding World Loot Crate unboxing. This is my second one of these, and it was very late this month. Usually, these arrive near the beginning of the month, and it is now the end of the month. They did send out an email around the time it was supposed to ship saying it was gonna be delayed. And I got a $10 off coupon for their loot store, which I appreciate. I probably won't use, but I appreciate the thought. So now it's here and we'll see what kind of magical goodness we have today. I think the theme for this box is Quidditch through the ages. I hope that's not the theme of the next one. I get my emails confused. So it has this lovely spell sticker on the front and I've already loosened it so we can dive right in. Let's see what we get. Ooh. This isn't the Quidditch of the Ages. This is the Beast Within, I'm pretty sure. And it looks like it's all Fantastic Beast theme, which I'm really excited about. Ooh. Okay, let's start with the shirt first. It's green, which is unusual. I'm not mad about it. Let's see. This is interesting. I think this is Nagini. If you've seen the new Fantastic Beast, The Crimes of Grindelwald, you'll know that Nagini was a person um, a maledictus who could turn into a snake. It's um, a blood disorder. And I guess eventually she becomes a snake forever. So I think that's what this is. It's really cool. I've never seen anything like that. At first I thought it was a Slytherin shirt. And I was about to get worried because I'm Hufflepuff. <laughs> you can't give me Slytherin merch. <laughs> okay. Next we have, oh, it's a mug. Let's open it. I love mugs. I have way too many. Um, when we are done renovating our house, I'm gonna have a little coffee bar area to so, like, display on my mug, so I'm super excited about that. Let's look at this. Oh. This is the water um creature that newt has in his apartment it says watch your fingers you don't want him to get it and i think it says the name of the kelpie oh because he's made of kelp <laughs> duh uh so yeah very cool i like that it's clear um that's a nice different uh, mug that you don't see every day most of them are ceramic and you can't see through them. So, oh, I'm gonna enjoy drinking my coffee out of this. I like that very much. Awesome. Let's put it back in its little protective packaging. I don't know what this is, but they're baby nifflers. Let's get them out. Oh, they're squishy. Baby Niffler Squishy Set is what it says. I'm going to get them all on my hand. Oh, this one. Okay. Here are the Baby Nifflers. This one is like sleeping on his back. Oh, are they just little squishes? Oh, these are cute. These will just go on my display with my other Fantastic Beast things with my nifflers. I really like it. This one kind of looks like a grim one. Um, but, yay. Okay. See, and that's something I've never seen before. It doesn't mean that it hasn't existed before, but I haven't seen it. Um, and it looks like we have a pen next. I don't know what it is, because it's all packaged up. I'm going to take a lot of things out of packaging this time. Ooh, 
It's the Matagot from Fantastic Beasts. We got a really pretty Thestral last time, and this is in the same style with the enamel and the gold outline. I really like that. Oh, I love that I'm getting so many different pens that I can put on a pen board. Very nice. Okay. He's telling me I need to own the Blu-ray. I don't think they know who their audience is because I already have it. The last thing it looks like that's in here is a little plaque. I can't see what it says because of the packaging. So out of the packaging we go. If I can. All right, let's see. Oh, this is cool. It's um, for the French Ministry of Magic. So it's in French, which I used to speak okay, but not so much anymore. So, oh, I really like the style. Very cool. And again, a really great display piece to go with all my other Fantastic Beast items, something that you can put in the background that um, other people probably won't have. Uh, before I show you the card, because that's the last item, this is the, oops. it's lovely. I wish I could display all the boxes, but it says Newt Scamander, Fantastic Beasts, somewhere to find them, and it's like the cover of the book. So, let's see what exclusives we got, what all is in here. Okay, the Beast Within. So, Quidditch Through the Ages will be the next box, which should come out, um, they're supposed to be January, March, May, um, but they always come the month after, so this will probably come in June. All of these are Loot Crate exclusives, so you have to have the Loot Crate subscription to get them. Even though there is some licensed merchandise in here, I like that it's Loot Crate exclusive. So, French Ministry 10 sign. Yep, Maledictus shirt. Um, so that is Nagini. Uh, the Kelpie tempered glass mug. The Oh, the Baby Niffler Swish squish stress toy set is what it says so these are meant to just squeeze a little life out of when you're stressed out which i don't want to squeeze a niffler when i'm stressed out there look look can you squeeze this face i don't think so and the matagot pen this is a good crate i really like this one i might like this one better than last months. Um, I love Fantastic Beasts. I love Newt's Commander. I'm really excited to see where they take the story um, based off of the last film, but Newt, of course, is a Hufflepuff, and I think his character is just great. I mean, I feel it's kind of like if I was a wizard, I would be the one just with all the animals that nobody else cared about, but that were misunderstood. Um, so I really relate to the character and I love that they've taken a character that we only heard the name of in passing before and built a whole film franchise around him, even though it's looking like it's more of a Dumbledore story. Um, I love that Newt is there at the center of everything. So we have a lot of things here that will be good for display. Also several practical things like the t-shirt and the mug, I'm gonna use this mug all the time. T-shirt will definitely wear. I'm gonna give it two thumbs up, even though it was a little late, it was worth the wait. I love all of these items. And I'm really excited to see what is in next month's Quidditch Through the Ages. That's how late this box was that I thought it was the theme for the next month, um, but no matter. So I hope everyone 
enjoy the video. If you did, please give it a like, subscribe if you want to see more unboxings. I'll be doing more soon, and I hope you all have a wonderful day.